Welcome to LJP Hello everyone, it's me once again. Hope you guys are well. Now, this is another um, Anti-Vector Rise of Community video and this video link was sent by a good friend of mine, a guy called uh, Dean, who I know from Anti-Vector uh, Facebook group page community. Uh, he sent me a link on Sunday, uh, I think it was 2, 3 o'clock in the morning. And I found out about um, five or six hours later when I woke up from my sleep and I thought, well, this better be good. And um, it was pretty good. So basically, um, a guy called uh, Gabriel uh, Almeida, let me just double check his username. I think it's Gabriel Al Almeida. I think it's his first video that he uploaded. And um, it was about a video clip, a very short video clip of showing by using Python that Vector can recognize the hand gestures. It's, big, it's just the beginning, everyone, but um, I think you won't believe me until I show it to you. So here it goes. But because it's a short video, I just want to explain to you very quickly. So you can see him filming himself on the left-hand side and the right-hand side, there are two small black and white screens. One is going to show you his hand gesture uh that it is actually seems to be focused on that green box that is actually shown on that screen uh but also below that it seems to be a circular somehow that recognized the number of fingers so i want you guys to look carefully on this short video clip so here it goes Zero. right so you can see that you can read the fingers and that circular sort of gaps, is that how is it reading it? That's amazing. So there you go. So why am I making this uh, video? Well, because it's just the beginning of hand gesture recognition. I mean, I'm actually keeping an eye on Google Pixel 4, for example, where everyone is so excited about this solid project, which is a hand gesture recognition by radar, while as this genius um, programmer called uh, Gabriel Almeida, he managed to use whatever vector already have with the camera, uh, which is not that good camera uh, from here, he managed to program it for a hand gesture. What does this mean? It's just the beginning, but technically I'm pretty sure uh, guys like um, Gabriel Almeida will be able to order vector with a hand gesture doing this, that, and then vector will move left and right and so on and um, this is why it's amazing I mean one of the things I just want to have a bit of beef about is that when I skim through anti vector group page on the Facebook that I registered through I have seen a few good numbers of people already selling this fantastic product while as um, rather than exploring it we need to gather people around and create a community to see what's the best thing we could get out of this robot it is a very good price robot for the potential they have i mean when anki started they have this is the initial thing what they've been saying there are infamous uh, potential that they could explore which we were eagerly waiting for until they shut down while as the aftermath of the anki vector shut down we have these Really brilliant programmers guy called like Gabriel Almeida uh, programming so that we could explore those in infinite like infinite uh, potentials with this brilliant robot with a very good price so the message is this uh, stop considering if you are considering selling this robot please don't be patient with it uh, see what you can do and if you are not sure whether you should buy anti vector or not well go through the um, videos that uh, the community on Facebook have people at the community vector Facebook community have been uploading see what other programmers are up to on YouTube and make your own decision on it and I have never regret buying this uh, robot and I'm still uh, in awe to see how such amazing small hamster sized robot can do so many things and I just want to give credit to once again my friend Dean on uh, Facebook and also um, the great programmer called Gabriel Almeida. So thank you very much for watching this video. It's, um, it's getting better and better with um, Anki Vector. So I'll keep you guys updated with it and the series are more to come along. So I hope you guys like these sort of videos clips. But um, anyway, thank you, bye-bye.